Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about uh, variables in C program, a small demo I'm going to give you, okay? So in the previous video I talked about uh, C variables, what are the, what is the purpose of C variables? So you can store a data and it is a symbolic representation for the data or the memory location. So for example, employee name, you have a data and you want to represent in your C program, that is called variables. I just talked about theoretical, but in this video I'm going to talk about a practical one in the sense I'm going to show you a very small program I've written and I'm going to execute that and show you look at this program there are three variables employee count John salary and gender okay so of type integer integer and character so employee count is of type integer John salary is of type integer and gender is of type character so uh, it is already defined declared define and initialized okay this, so these variables three variables are already defined and initialized then I'm going to print in the console a very simple program okay so what is variable definition means a variable definition means we are telling to the compiler where and how much to create the storage for this particular variable we are just informing the compiler a variable definition specifies a data type here you can see a data type of it here it's integer and and it contains a list or one or more list of one or more variables like this so of data type and list of variables okay in the above program int employee count both declares and defines and initializes as well which instruct the compiler to create variable named employee count of type int okay so um, let me show you this program I have already written .c program 678 is very important for us because we are defining and initializing three variables of type int and character I have already compiled this program and I have created the exe So I'm going to execute this so you can see in the in the console we are able to see these three variables. Hope this video is useful. Thank you.